So Wi-Fi is a wireless way of getting access to internet. And as a result, we're bombarded by these radio waves. So can we use them to say something about the environment, about the objects? Because these signals interact with their objects. So then we have this very natural question. How much can they tell us about the environment? We basically wanted to see x-ray vision with Wi-Fi. So imagine there is an area, there are walls, and behind those walls there's an object. Let's say two robots move outside of the area. One is transmitting a signal with a Wi-Fi card and the other one is receiving. And that transmission, it goes through the object. In a sense, we can say they leave a signature on the signal. And that signature is what we're trying to use and from that reception figure out something about the object. And the more measurements they can collect, they can do that imaging better. That means being able to tell you the location of the objects, their geometry and shape. We've shown that you can actually do this. But we actually could do a little bit more because what we extract also tells us something about the material property. And so what we hope is that in the future, we should be able to say something more about what kind of object is there. A very good application is search and rescue. So imagine the Japan tsunami in 2011. In such a scenario, for instance, a nuclear spill, and it's too dangerous for humans to go in. It would be great if we can have unmanned vehicles that from outside can assess the situation inside and figure out what's going on inside behind walls and then help guide humans to safe areas. What did you think of the video? Let us know in the comments below and make sure to subscribe to Figure One.